But boy missing for hours overnight found safe this morning. 11 year old Kenneth Andre Knooper vanished after leaving home on his bike. He was found this morning at a friend's house in a nearby neighborhood. Channel 2's Jake Reiner with the emotional reunion. Kenny was found at a friend's house in this area near Black Hawk and Thursa, not far from his Forest Bend Avenue home. Despite the short distance, it was a long night for police and family to try to find him. Bewildered on no sleep, a shoeless, scared 11 year old slowly emerges from his father's car. It's better. Better to be home. 62 years old, this is my trophy right here. Manfred and Debbie Knupfer adopted Kenny when he was nine days old. They tell us he has a mild form of Asperger's and was not on his meds last night. He just left on his bike to go see a friend like he normally does. That was the last time his mother saw him. Friends with police say he also was spotted near the holiday parade route Saturday around five in the afternoon. Kevin is the Knupfer's biological son. He says everyone started searching around 8.30. Look till about 3 in the morning, just up and down every street. Where were you, Kenny? Hmm? Where were you? At my friend's house. We just sat around watching videos. What's unclear is why didn't Kenny's friend's parents call? Miscommunication, apparently. The family says they plan to follow up. What is clear, mom's arms look like the safest place in the world. At least to Kenny they are. In Friendswood, I'm Jake Reiner, KPRC, Channel 2 News. President